it's been a while since I uploaded a YouTube video and I thought it was about time that I started to do that again. This channel is not only going to be like a music channel anymore, I kind of want it to be like a vlog too. I'm going to have to edit this because I still kind of struggle with the camera. I didn't really think about what I was going to say. I was just looking back at my videos and I wasn't really happy with what I was putting out there. So by the time you watch this, all of my videos would have been archived. It's a fresh start. Yeah, if you might have noticed, I changed my YouTube channel name. It's not Unfazed Ashley anymore. So Ashley's gone there. I was thinking of Ashlyn, but I think it'd be kind of cool. The person that becomes recognized is like me my name and I don't have to pretend to be anything. I'm just, I'm happy to be back. Whoever's watching or whoever's like on this video. I'm just very excited to take you guys along uh, into my life. Uh, this video is basically gonna be uh, a week in my life, but not technically a week because I'm not gonna film every single day because I don't have something interesting to do every single day. But today was a very important step for me as a musician. I got an electric guitar today. I got an electric guitar. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you later. called Guitar Nook. It's in Biscayne Boulevard? It's wrong, I'm gonna put the address down. But it's called the Guitar Nook. I think I said that already. Awesome. Look at how disgusting these are. I have to redo these on Saturday because I'm going on an anniversary trip. My boyfriend, he played for this band called Bravi Band. The lead guitar player is like an employee of this shop. And he was the one that like took care of me and my boyfriend when we went over to buy a guitar. And he was so sweet. Like he helped us out a lot and he helped me a lot since I'm fairly new to guitar. Like I only know like three to four chords. He really helped me like understanding the differences between sounds. Cause I was like sitting there and I was just playing A minor, G, C over and over again on different guitars and I'm like to be honest I can't hear the difference so I, I wouldn't know which guitar to pick and he sat down and he was like Whatever, it was beautiful. I actually heard the difference. I got my guitar and I got an amp, a strap, I got the whole setup, the whole entire setup. Before I start off showing you what I got, I kind of want to show you like my string family collection i think i just want to show you so you can kind of see like the upgrades the upgrades i'm gonna start off by showing you my guitar i have two acoustic guitars but i like this one better because the other one has nylon strings i find it a lot better to play on these type of strings i don't know the name but they're like hard stuff and as you can see it is a first act this is basically a guitar you can literally buy from Walmart. It has two, two, two cute angel numbers. My stepdad found it at like a dumpster or something and it was in really good condition. And I haven't touched my other guitar ever since. So this is what it sounds like. Out of tune. So the problem with this guitar is that it's on this. Is it on this string? Yes, it's on this string. You see the copper stuff has moved and it broke, which makes this string sound really, really bad. This is my little ukulele. If anyone knows me, I've been in middle school, I used to carry this around all the time, all the time. I bought this in Sam Ash and it was like, it was $80, $90. It is a Makala ukulele, kind of what it looks like. It's this very dark 
wooden color and I like it very, very much. I used to bring it to school all the time. So this is my new baby. As you can see, it's a Fender. This is like my setup. So this is my little gig bag and it has a front pocket here and I'm gonna show you what it brings. Here is the cable for the actual amp to plug in the amp. Here's my guitar cable, which used to be on, I literally just put it on the acoustic. And here's the guitar cable. So that's it for the first bar. This case, this case is pretty good. It's like really small. It's not like, fits the guitar perfectly. It's not excessive. Hi guys. Okay, so here's the fender. The zippers are up here. And we are going to open it. Baby, I know it looks so pretty. It's so pretty. This is my guitar, she's super pretty. And I got this strap, I'm getting used to like carrying it. My shoulders get like really heavy sometimes. She is a Fender Squire Tornado, she's a Squire, I think, mixed with a Paul. Get I don't I, if I believe I'm probably wrong and it has I'm pretty sure this is a jazz master body I could be completely wrong I had to choose between this or an actual squire like the classic uh, 50s vibe I went with um the tornado squire because I didn't really like the tone of the of the classic vibe the 50s one and that is because this one has a more warm tone kind of like my boyfriend's Gretsch guitar which is pink I'll put a, I'll put like a picture of it or a video but it is it is beautiful that guitar is beautiful but so is my baby again I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about the Squire had more of like a twangy which is what I was told a twangy tone which I mean, I liked, but after a while, like hearing it again and again, it kind of sounded like Surfer Boy song. This is the tone, and this is why I chose. This is the tone that I like. This is the guitar. This is the tone that I like. There we go. Now I'm gonna show you the unboxing of my amp. After the unboxing, I'll be showing you like how my amp works and stuff. <laughs> Fender amp is just modern. It's the Mustang LT25. Here's the amp. Hello. Here, here's the gain, the volume, treble bass, master. These are kind of the levels that I'm at right now. The aux, the headphones, input. Here's what's cool. Okay, this is not on and off USB. You can hold here, and then you can tune your guitar. You can go back. The menu and i'll explain this later so basically if you scroll you get like a bunch of sound effects so here's fender clean silky solo chicago blues classic rock dreamy country picking there's so so much 
but then here's the there's empty spaces and basically what this means is that i can like go on my computer save an effect that i like put it on here and like click save and then the sound effect would be there which i think is pretty cool It also sound like this. It's so cool. So yeah, that's the guitar. Good morning. It is July 12th. And today I'm gonna take you along to the pool and to work. Hi guys, I'm already for work. I work at Taco Bell. I'm a cashier. So I'm gonna take you. I'm not gonna vlog much, but I'll probably vlog like in order or something. I get out at like five today and I go and work in like 10 minutes. Taco Bell, can I help you? Two chicken quesadillas. One chicken quesadilla. Do you want it with spicy sauce or without? Anything else? Verify the order on the screen and make sure everything's correct. 1046, thank you.